a great way of keeping fit and exploring the nation's capital is to actually do a tour of London. Now there's various different tours you can do. You can do both an organised tour, a walking tour, a bus tour, or you can get your hiking boots on, arm yourself with a map and explore London's many streets. Now we're here in Holborn to find out about London's historical past. Now for a truly supernatural safari, begin your walking tour here at Holborn Viaduct. It's called a viaduct because it actually crosses over a subterranean river known as the River Fleet. Now it is here on this bridge that you will see some ginormous winged dragons and also some griffins, which are the emblem of the city of London. Now griffins are known to guard buried treasure and the treasure that these griffins are actually guarding are the vaults of gold at the Bank of England, the financial heart of the country. Now there's been talk of flying winged creatures like dragons and griffins over London since 1200. Now back in 1700 there was rumour of a giant winged serpent over Hammersmith. Now we're going to continue on with our tour now. We're taking the steps down from the viaduct onto Farringdon where we're going to hit Bear Alley. So we're now at Bear Alley and it's here. This area here was used as a bear baiting ring back in the medieval time. Now there's lots of areas around London where actually there's been bear baiting rings. But it's here in Bear Alley that there's been sightings of ghostly bears. Behind us is the River Fleet. Now back in the 1700s there used to be seal in the River Fleet. And beneath the road surface in the drains and the sewers they could hear sounds of wild boar. There's also a rumour of a carnivorous tribe that used to live beneath the streets of London as well. So we've walked down Farringdon and we come onto Fleet Street and just about 20 metres down on the left hand side is a tiny passageway known as St Bride's Passage. Now it's here that you find this lovely little church known as St Bride's Church, the Church of Journalists as it was known because it's right on the edge of Fleet Street which is where all the newspapers used to be printed. They're not anymore, they're all done on the outskirts of London. But if you look up at the steeple of St Bride's Church, it looks like a wedding cake. And that's because it is. It is the inspiration behind the traditional tiered wedding cake enjoyed by many brides and grooms around the world today. So we're now at the side of the Royal Courts of Justice and right behind me just here we've got the Temple Bar Memorial and on top of it you can see one of the largest griffins we've actually got here in the capital. Now this is actually the boundary which separates the city of Westminster, which I'm currently in right now, and the city of London, which is uh, just over there. And that's where we started our tour and this is where we're going to end it.